today I'll be teaching you how to get rid of a phone virus. <laughs> Psych? Phones can't catch vi- wait, can they? Here's a fun fact. It is nearly impossible for a phone to catch a virus. In fact, you may never come across one in your life. But if you do ever get a virus on your phone, then it may be one, a scam to con you of your money, or two, it was transferred from a malicious software, either from your computer or a public computer, onto your phone. So yeah, let's get rid of this petty virus. Mmm, yeah, it's just an excuse for me to dip my phone in water. Warning. This warning is not a professional warning. Don't f***ing try this shit at home, kids. <laughs> Let's get started. What's going on, guys? Vinci D here from Get Fix, and today we'll be testing out how well the Samsung Galaxy S6 S Plus holds up to water. This is a test for the love of curiosity, and yes, this is my personal phone, which makes it that much more scarier to do. Ah, uh, what, what the f is wrong with me? <laughs> Let's start off with something simple. This to see how well the phone does when being splashed with water. So for example, if you accidentally take a shower with your phone, then you can accidentally mess it up. But let's just see how well this test pans out. So far so good. This phone is actually starting to convince me that it is water resistant. Yeah, let's just act like I have a real reason for why I'm about to dip my extremely expensive phone in water. Oh yeah, yeah, there you go. See, the phone caught a virus. <laughs> Samsung does not advertise that the Samsung Galaxy S6 S Plus is water resistant and can also hold up to being submerged in water, but this test may just prove that it can. I think we need to turn up the intensity just a little bit more. Next stop, level 1000. Let's put it in a bowl of water to see how well it holds up. Just a reminder, I've had this phone for about three and a half weeks now and I'm taking a big risk for the love of technology. So definitely go super sane on that like button. Samsung does not advertise that the Samsung Galaxy S6 S Plus is water resistant and can hold up to being submerged in water. But this test definitely proves that it can. If you would like to see more videos of this nature, be sure to subscribe so you'll be notified when I upload how to repair water damaged phone in the Samsung Galaxy S6 S Plus review. Once these videos are uploaded, you should be able to click on them to watch. It's been about a minute now, time to see if there's anything wrong with this phone. Moments after I took the phone out of the water, my camera's battery died. So if you would like to see what happened to the Samsung Galaxy S6 S Plus, then you may want to click the button up here. Starting today, at the end of every video, I'll be doing something called Roll Call, where I shout out and thank the 5 most recent subscribers on this channel. If you want to be mentioned in the next video, then you already know what to do. Roll Call, please. Zoe Swiftheart, Mark Mark. Shadrick, I actually know this dude in person. He's a pretty cool guy. <laughs> Osvaldo Gillian. And once again, Osvaldo Gillian. He actually subscribed to me twice. I'm not sure why, but thank you, dude. I feel <laughs> I feel honored. Anyways, guys, it's been GD here from Get Fixed and I'm out. Peace.